Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm gonna show you a few ways you can make many looks for Goku on his gi uh, without having to make a custom or sculpting or even painting. It's all gonna be just original parts, just replace some parts from here to there and you will have many options for Goku. You see on the last few years we got many Gokus and many looks for Goku. We got the Super Saiyan Blue from Broly movie, we got the Ultra Instinct, the the Ultra Instinct Omen Goku, we got the Saiyan Raised on Earth, the Awakening, we got even the 2.0 Kaioken Goku. So all of these Gokus have like different parts. They are similar but have some different parts. So now since we have these many parts we can exchange them with each, with each other and we will have other looks. So let's get started. So, as you can see, the first one here is the Super Saiyan Blue Goku. I would say this is from the Super uh, Dragon Ball Super Trunks arc, the future arc. Okay, what I did here, this is a Super Saiyan Blue Goku. I changed the belt. I bought this uh, from, I took a bootleg and I just took the belt and it looks great. Other option you can do is just buy a uh, belt from any customizer who can make it. Or you can do the same as I did, or make your own. Just do what you like to have these belts. But I don't advise you to take it from like Super Saiyan God or even uh, Super Saiyan Three bodies because it's uh, it's really it's really gonna affect the look of the Super Saiyan Three. And these figures are expensive, so you don't wanna break it or anything. Number two, I took the Super Saiyan Blue head and just paint it and added some parts. So you don't need to do that because you can just use the Super Saiyan Blue head, it looks great. But this is a custom I did like many years and I just like it on this body. You see the hands have different band colors because these bands are from the Saiyan Raised on Earth there on the back. The Saiyan Raised on Earth body, that's why it looks purplish more than it's darker blue. I'll get to this one in a sec. So all you have to do here, if you like this look, get the Super Saiyan Blue, change the belt, and for the hands, you just take these hands off and put the Saiyan Raised on Earth ones. Be careful when you take it apart, it's hard, so make sure to use hot water and be careful not break your figure. Let's get this one out of the way. The second one is this one. See, when we got the Omen Goku, it's an exclusive, it's expensive, I know. But if you can get it, that's nice. If you can, just get the demonical fit. So to get this look, you can just change the head with the same raised on earth and take the same raised on earth belt as I did here. Sorry for that. As I did here, I took the belt, I took the head and put them on this guy. So for the belt, this Ultra Instinct Goku comes with a belt look like that. But the difference between this one and the Ultra Instinct Mastered is the Mastered Ultra Instinct, the two parts, the blue part, which is this one. And the orange part are glued together with super glue, so it's hard to take them off, and I don't advise you to do that. But the exclusive one, it just not glue, it just put there. You see, there are some holes in here. I don't know if you can see it, but there are some holes. You can just take it off and just have two pieces so that's what I did I took them off I took the orange piece only as you can see here I took the orange piece and added the same raised on earth belt and that way now I have the spirit pump Goku from the Frieza battle except the shoes and I'm not gonna get into that because I don't wanna ruin my figure otherwise I can use the same raised on earth shoes hot water try to take them off easily and then change them if you if you know how to do that if you don't just keep safe and stay with this one okay next one is this Super Saiyan angry Goku from the Frieza battle okay these two are the same form except two different ways to do them this one if you have the same uh, the Super Saiyan awakening Goku you can take the belt put it on the ultra instinct body and add this blue part for it that will give you that look and of course not the shoes but you know how it is and the Super Saiyan head that way you can have the 
Super Saiyan angry Goku and you can have him battle in Frieza. If you don't have the Super, the Super Saiyan Awakening Goku, you can just use this guy. Ultra Instinct with Saiyan raised on Earth Goku. Same as before, just took the other part, which is the damaged body here, as you can see. And the blue piece with the belt. This is another option. So these two options are available. You can just choose what's available. You will be left with this buddy and just give him the lift of the belt and you will have another Goku that is also damaged I don't know what's wrong with the focus okay let's get it here yeah just add the belt and you will have this look of Goku it's like from the original Brody movie the damaged Goku or uh, Android 13 or whatever next we have the Kaioken Goku very simple get the belt if you can this one is a bit red as you can see oh, I'm sorry about that okay this one is a red belt with the 2.0 Goku Kaioken body and just put the Super Saiyan blue head over it and just that's it it's very simple but very nice this Goku I would call it leftover pieces same as this Goku but as you can see they look great I know this belt isn't perfect but when you are left with these you just don't want to throw them or just put them in the bag so you want to use them with that Goku so you can have a figure that you can pose or whatever in the background or any other way next I showed you these, these two now last but not least I'm just gonna get into this one as you can see this is the uh, let me just get it closer okay okay this is future Gohan but the difference is I didn't use any third party uh, head or hands or whatever this is the original figure I just did some alterating alteration to it so I took the great Saiyan Super Saiyan head put it on the body of Goku raised on earth put the scratch on the face you can just use some paper or stickers you don't have to use paint and for the hands I just put some blue duct tape here and there to have the long shirt I did the same I remove this hand from the left arm only so you you will be left with the joint you just fold the joint as you can see it inside you just fold it and you wrap it with duct tape so you will have this uh, nice look the front uh, gi logo I didn't want to remove it with any uh, uh, alcohol or whatever so I just kept it and add a piece of paper sticker paper and painted it with orange color so that way from far you will not see any logo the shoes which is the hardest part I just put some duct tape if you buy any third party company head for Gohan you will not get the shoes with it but here you can just put some duct tape and add the lines over the yellow to give you the uh, blue shoes as you can see the, the yellow line you just put some duct tape over it and try to take your measures right it will look great if you really want a future Gohan and for the back I just put my custom stickers uh, Gohan logo and you can get this from my eBay uh, store just put them on the figure and you will have a cheap alternative for future Gohan alright so let's count our figures we got one Gohan one Goku we got the other Goku which is the one in the back we got this Goku the Goku with the belt without having to buy any uh, belt from outside we have the Kaioken blue we have the second angry Goku we have the same raised on earth with different hand bands that's it and of course the Super Saiyan blue which is the perfect Super Saiyan blue and the spirit bomb Goku 
thank you guys for watching i'll try to post more videos in the future and bye